Hello everyone, this is Luigi the Kid 94 here. Back to the back with another part of Mario Kart 8 Online Races Part 8. Yeah, how exciting. Just kidding, this is fun. Playing David Luigi here with a golden car, slick wheels, and still rocking the gold glider. Yeah, I, really, I like using it now. This is weird. Unlike in Mario Kart 7, I don't really like riding in different cars other than the standard cart and also the pipe frame. And how is that missing everyone? What the fuck? That red shit did not hit me. It was not even going for me at all. I mean, that's what I was saying. The slick wheels, also the golden glider, I don't really like playing as in Mario Kart 7, but now I do in this game. Maybe because it looks better. Trust me, it does look better. And what else I don't like that I didn't do in Mario Kart 7? Mm, I roll as a golden car a lot. Don't like it I'm light as hell though. But hey, it's something. And we also here into the for Yoshi's Valley. I don't know if you've ever seen been here before though. But this place is actually pretty cool. Back in the end of the war, you really couldn't tell who was who in the first place until the end of the um stage. But now you can. I really didn't expect the stage to come back. But it's back. So this making that warrior stage from Mario Kart 64 the only stage from that game not to come back as a retro stage. I didn't really like that stage at all though. I think it was pretty long. Even though you're playing at a higher difficulty, it's still long though. I didn't really like it. But this... I think everybody likes this place for some reason. I think because the different multiple pa the multiple paths you can take though, like this one. I took that one because back in the end of the you could take that road. Since it's like, faster. And the CPUs usually don't. I think they take that path. But I really don't think they take the bridge way. I, like I said, I don't really care about the CPUs at all. I just focus on me, 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 and me. And me. And I was about to use that red. But no, a shock happens. But can I at least win though? Even though I light? I picked this one for him since his speed is a little bit... It's on the good side. On the good side, but his weight is more on the border side of medium. Also, I won. Eh, I'll see you guys in the next race. Again. We're back with TikTok Clock. Mario Kart DS, this TikTok clock. <laughs> One main thing about this stage that I also liked it in Mario Kart DS, and I always like to go here, and also fall off for no apparent reason. But now the stage is back, finally. That is pretty much cool, again. This is pretty much this, and Instaport. What the hell again with these red shells? This and an Instaport Rainbow Road is pretty much the only retro tracks I actually like. I don't really like the other retro tracks in this game as much. That's just me. Oh my god, again. Can I stop getting hit with red shells, please? Can I stop getting the item rates? Which seems to happen a lot. You're getting hit by one item. And I have one coin. I am broke. Make that two coins. I'm still broke. Well, it's not like complain about the um, coins. Even though I had like 10,000 coins, so I don't care anymore. Wow, bullet. I like how the way they hold a bullet bill in this game. And also didn't like it that it didn't even help me at all. Why do you seem like the powerful items seem to be nerfed? Like the star doesn't even go as fast anymore. The freaking bullet bill doesn't go as like lightning speed anymore. I think it's because um depends where you are, how far you're away from how far away from anyone else, so I'm pretty much guessing that's from pretty much why. Also I need to get at least first place. No more reds, no more reds please. I think every part, well every race I've been here, I'm always getting hit by a triple reds or just a single red shell. At least I've stopped for now. Can I get at least in the top three? Ugh, single shroom. This would do 
wonderful. I think. Nope, I came in fourth. I like third, but y'all can get what you want. I'll see you guys in the next race again. Last race, Water Park, which is the most generic name of all. Water Park. Why can't I just call it like Waluigi's Water Park? No, he already got a pinball. Call it someone, like, put like a random name into it. Like, this, like, freaking Wario theme, like, Water Park or something. Call it, like, Wario's Water Park. I guess you don't want to call it that because, um, Wario owns the track already. But still call it something other than Water Park. It's such a generic name. Like, hey, you want to go to Water Park? Hey, what Water Park? Um, it's called Water Park. Really? Like, there's a bunch of Nokis here. Call it, like... No, that probably sounds even worse. I'm gonna call it Nokis... Like a Noki water park. But at least... At least Subcoaster. I thought this track was called Subcoaster. Because it had a big letter right there. Probably would like it being called a Subcoaster. Nice try with the bomb. Oh, what's a green shell? I should use his bananas, but I just want to keep him as defensive more than offense. Okay, so if I get into the item, it'll probably be a coin. No one is scan, I'll probably get a coin anyway. Like, I think because I'm in third, you shouldn't really get coins as much. Because you get better items and like in second or third place more than you do in last place. Because in last place, you can get a single green shell. Or a single red shell. Like... You're in last. At least give me a bullet bill or a star or mushrooms or something. Give me something that's helpful. What, what, what good is a coin going to do? Coins, yay. That's so offensive. Offensive item, though. Oh, God, fireballs. No fire. Stop with the fire. Can you get the last item? Oh, how fun. Yay, coins. I don't need any coins, I have 10 coins it is. That's weird.